Right, a quick tour of a Glade Hill Gulfstream the user controls. Let's zoom in on the control area. There we are. Now, this is the on off control. This turns the whole thing off and back on again. You have a time switch here which operates the central heating alone. It uh, doesn't affect the thermal store at all. The thermal store is hot all the time. The time clock simply operates the central heating radiator boiler, uh, sorry, the radiator pump. Um, should the boiler ever lock out through failure to light um, or a gas fault or something wrong with the gas train, then the reset button will pop out and you'll get an ignition lockout light here or here. And this button here needs to be pressed. If the boiler should overheat, there's a reset button underneath this. <laughs> Unscrews. There we are. A lot of people don't realise that. Press the button in, put the top back on, the boiler will burst back into life. And the last thing is this control here, which is the called the switch backup. If the gas fails, then you can turn this switch to the hot water only position for emergency hot water operated by mains electricity. And similarly, you can turn it up to position two for emergency heating and hot water together cost you an arm and a leg to run them both on electricity so uh, best not to if you, if you don't need to but there we are those are the user controls in a nutshell thank you for watching